Hey hi hello welcome back to my new video this is Sampath you are watching Sampath Samfax YouTube channel and this is POCO X3 custom ROM reviews this is a pixel extended OS as you can see version 5.4 based on February sorry January 5th 2023 is the security patch I thought it's a February security patch but it's still stuck with January security patch and under version is quite obviously under 13 that's fine here but the security patch is older and kernel user is 4.14.10 the same kernel what i shown in the pixel experience one and you can see the build number pixel x 5.4 this is the february 18th build this is latest one and i have been running some benchmark results and cpu throttling test you can see cpu throttling test the maximum is around like 190 average 186 and minimum of 166 and good thing is it's no cpu throttling detected i mean thermal cpu throttling has been zero here i mean it's 100 percent there is no throttling has been done which is excellent in my opinion according to this app actually and one more thing regarding charging it fi first time it shows like this charging later after certain time it shows charging rapidly you can see here but the time they mentioned full in 1 hour 39 minutes is little bit higher even if it is a charging rapidly only why that it is showing but it takes little bit of time and there's a geekbench results you can see 734 is the single score and multi score is 1867 and kernel as i said before 4.14.10 laum 9.1 kernel has been given this is the typical home screen you get widgets are working quick settings panel is fine here all this pixel os pixel experience and this pixel extended all have this kind of uh, brightness toggle i really don't like it i don't know uh, how you apple have that like that and this is the edit section even here also there is no option of automatic brightness sensor toggle that's simply missing the other toggles are fine here you can see dark theme location all are working fine the smoothness in the quick settings panel is also so very good and this is a typical home scan as i said before and this is app to her and if you press and hold here you get changed to wallpapers and widgets as i said before and even home settings has been given and regarding me like a camera i made a dedicated video in some of the roms even i use this magic here too in some of the roms the camera application will not work like this it get crashed here also it is getting crashed only in certain roms it's working you need to root that and some of the people are worrying about how if i root my smartphone and i want to use like a camera then you can make this hide here then if you check the safety net status it might show you get passed you need to hide it it is showing still fail you have an option to hide them as you can see settings hide the magic app. okay it is hiding right now now if you check that Mm, okay it reboots the magics anyhow let's check the uh, safety net status again will be okay i need to close the safety net status now i reopen that I run the test it's still showing failed that's the thing uh, people worried one in order to use the mua camera they need to root the smartphone that's why they are worrying nothing bad here if you want the camera you can do it but in this rom pixel extent and i will show you in every each and every video by flashing the similar method like using this magic and this model i will show you whether it will work or not based on that you can root your smartphone but currently it's not working the mio camera you can use the arno build gcam that i always recommend in order to use the camera in these kind of roms now moving into drm information again here you get level one certification also you can judge the app opening time guys now the anti 2 the geekpen 6 is not that great but that's how i am showing this course on 3 lakh 71 and temperature raise was 3.3 degrees celsius and battery drop off two percentage has been done in this particular pixel extended at 5.4 based on january security patch that's a little bit of disappointment because we are already end of february now the last week has started but that's how it is and uh, 
overall experience of this ui is really good and uh, there's a typical home screen and app done as i said before let's move into settings here and in the pe extension again network traffic monitor you get display mode and system icons you can enable or disable 4g icons small mobile type again tap to sleep is actually you can see status bar or lock screen only works tap to wake everywhere it works clock position again you can position them if you want to show seconds and mpm style battery style status only three are given nothing more here as you can see status bar if you swipe here lock screen customization again double tap if you want to check the phone you can enable from the triple effect and udff fps customization has been given system nothing more again here hardware level fingerprint success and error vibration you can enable or disable from here this is the customization you get in pe extension nothing more here. you don't even get the option to increase the ifs but uh, google photos unlimited storage is available on all these pixel roms i'll give a poll section tonight or evening i don't know when i'll give select the appropriate rom among these three pixel experience pixel uh, extended and the pixel os uh, my preference will be pixel os let's see how people will vote for that and the battery life as you can see thermal profiles has also given battery usage you can see monday tuesday it's showing something different i really liked it the graph battery saver again extreme battery saver will get battery life going to be a moderate here nothing bad nothing great to display again you can see here you get a dark theme options there is a little bit of black okay use black theme that's fine here i really liked it in every rom they could implement this and live display is also again colors again you can keep it out there are some options but it's unknown i don't want to use that let's keep it to saturated or else boosted okay and other tap to sleep as i said those are working fine ambient display those things are also working fine no problem regarding that and accessibility menu which is a handy feature just enable that by using that without actually using the physical buttons you can use the volume toggles and even the brightness sliding and recent apps lock screen other settings you can access from here that's why it's an accessibility menu other audio these things you can adjust from here now moving into security again you get a fingerprint unlock and face unlock let me show you the face unlock and fingerprint unlock as you can see the fingerprint unlock that wobbling effect is still present now let's see face unlock it is taking a little bit of time okay it's getting unlocked the face unlock and fingerprint unlock speeds are really really quick in this particular rom let's show you the bgm and wind of this video Typically again you get similar graphic settings smooth plus ultra or HD or high recommend to play in smooth plus ultra and using this magic models you can even increase the FPS It is fine the gameplay and even the volume level I kept around 60% it's also fine here. It is fine. All the three have equal performance but I felt Pixel OS has great experience in the user interface but uh, it all depends upon you also some may not like the pixel os maybe pixel experience is better for them because of anx camera support the mio leica whereas here the leica camera hasn't getting worked here i will come back here and uh, let's show this settings and system and there is no option of gestures also here I don't know and uh, that's it guys this is pixel extended 5.4 with january security patch i think they should update the security patch at least but overall it's a very good rom you can have it as an option if you don't like pixel extended or sorry pixel experience of pixel os then you can switch to this but as i said again the mail like a camera is not working in this particular rom 
that's it we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keep smiling bye bye for now